People can see, well, this is the way we measure the ground water. And I guess we can try with this or don't know how to measure the ground water. We have a sort of a meter. And uh, when this, with electrical springs on the sides, and when this meter, there is a hole in the middle, when this uh, goes down to the water, there will be an uh, electrical current and we will have a sound at the surface. I can uh, show you this on the days here. Yeah. So, um, this is just to see how can we uh, find out about the geology. And we have a very good internet service uh, here where we can, from all the country, we can see existing boreholes. And that's what we use. We use existing boreholes to say, well, if we should make a hole here, we don't know exactly what it is, but we can look at this and that. And maybe they are only 3 meters deep, then we can't use them, maybe they are 50 meters deep. So it will all, you can't know for 100% sure. But you have to make an estimation, you have to make a guess, saying, well, we think it's this or that. So, uh, I think this is, yeah, this is just a um, geothermal gradient. It can vary from place to place. And here is a uh, typical, this is from northern Newtland, and in fact, the uh, number two here is from my house, 